All right, boys. So let's go ahead and get into this Graves gameplay. So it looks like there's a Malzahar top. That's a really, really easy gank. Um, the jungle matchup, it's like okay for us. Um, we actually should win early uh, versus Kindred. Uh, mid lane, pretty easy gank as well. Uh, bot lane, really easy gank. We have really, really hard winning lanes. So um, could be a good idea to go ahead and uh, invade into Kindred. And maybe do some vertical jungling. But uh, we'll see exactly what our plan should be, okay? We're going to drop that ward. Go back to spawn. Do the ward trick. So basically, we're just going to put this ward down. Go back, switch to a red trinket. And then we'll be ready, uh, you know, when our first camp spawns. So we'll have a red trinket uh, as we gank, okay? So this is something I'm a bit curious on. Okay. So, the way we're going to jungle this game is based on where we see Kindred starting, okay? So, I'm going to look at the lanes and see where she starts. And then I'll decide if I want to play more aggro in their jungle. Or if we're just going to fight her at Crab. Alright. So pretty good leash. Uh, you know, as we're jungling, we want to make sure that we have um, full passive stacks on Graves. So right now we're at three stacks. I really want a 2v2 up top or mid uh, because we should be able to win really, really hard early. Especially since... Uh, oh, oh my god, I reset, cr I reset Gromp. I am trolling today. Jesus. Okay, we're actually gonna be late. That happens, you know? Oh. That's life sometimes. It's okay, so like worst case scenario, you get to see like what happens in like, you know, these worst case scenarios. Like how it inf influences the game, how it impacts the game. Uh, it shouldn't be too bad though, honestly. Like even th that was bad itself, cause I literally didn't get any damage on the big wolf, but it's okay. Like, highly inefficient jungling, but, you know, that will happen sometimes. I go ahead and dash here, because I want to keep my eight stacks. Look how tanky we are, right? We don't take any damage from jungle camps, because we have 92 armor at level 3. The, the thing of why I like this so much is because when we have this much armor, if we ever get invaded, you usually just like take the fights because you're so tanky, it doesn't matter. Now this is now the, the part of why this is really bad is because that mark just spawned, guys. Oh, and we don't have dash either. But we're going to hit this plan, keep our stacks up. I think she's on bot crab. Yeah, she... It's not worded right now. Let him push. Let him push. Let him push. Let him push. We're gonna go in here. It's perfect. Smoke screen. Alright, we've kicked him out of lane. We're gonna do golems here and reset. Might be a good idea to push the lane, but push, push, push. Push the lane, let him go back, force TP, probably. Or he's gonna miss this wave, yeah, he TP'd. That's why we wanna push the lane, force the TP. Okay, barge roaming mid, he's doing barred things. Dodge. It's probably still dead. Oh, he kills Ziggs. Perfect. Nice. He ults out. That's perfect. Uh, he's level 4. How many camps does he have? 25? 
So he shouldn't have invaded us here. But he did come from the top side, but um yeah, he didn't actually didn't back, so maybe he did. Maybe it's a grump. I just don't know. Okay, he didn't take grump. He definitely has took that crab though, right? Took it a while ago, actually. Reset Grump again. It's a shame that uh, the Mark spawned on that side. We're nowhere near. Shit, he has crabs. So I can't really do Dragon either. I'm gonna go do his Golems, though. We can dive them here. Okay, we're just getting them low here. Kindred's here, so we're just gonna get the fuck out. We got the bard. We got the kindred as well. I wanna get this uh, red buff here. The thing is, like, their guy probably is gonna spawn soon. I mean, uh, he already spawned, but he's gonna be here. Like, they if they're they're not stupid. Like, there's no way they don't come check this. Need to do this quick and get out. Okay, there's Kindred. Uh, she might try and do uh, dragon here. Killer. Nice, and we got the steel as well. The stepping in these. Okay, we got that kill as well. At the expanding, like we more TP'd, so that's a bit. Um, that was a good play. Uh, we put down the ward so he could TP. We saw that he TP. Uh, he pinged his TP, so. Good play overall. We got the steal as well. We got another kill. Um, we're, we're snowballing. We're snowballing. So I can't wait for these grave buff, graves buffs to hit because I think he'll be really, really strong. Especially since his early clear will be buffed a bit. So like I don't want to. I want to stress this enough that like you know even though we messed up our clear early, like. You know, we're still we're still okay, like you know. Shit will go wrong in the game sometimes, but it doesn't really matter. You can always come back from it. If like you dwell on it, you'll play like a lot worse, you know? Let's see what's happening mid. I'm actually gonna push his lane here. It's really important that we push this lane here. Okay, Kindred's level 6, so I want to make sure that I go into her jungle here. She has no camps up right now, though, but she's probably going to path towards her uh, topside jungle because uh, she knows she doesn't have any camps on the uh, bot side outside of, like, golems, right? So, yeah. If she goes straight and she ganks um, bot, then, like, that's fine with us, too, because we get rift for free. So we're going to hover around the top side of the map here. Looks like, yeah, she's ganking, so we, we take this. We take this here. Let's 
So that was good of Kindred because she assumed that all her topside camps were gone. I underestimated her and I thought she'd just go check. Um, so yeah, there was she probably did golems into bot, which was like the only play she had. But yeah, um, we're gonna take this Rift Herald and then uh, try and go top with it. He wants to go mid with it, but I don't think that's the play. Okay, we have a lot of gold, so. Oh, we actually should have farmed a little bit. We're gonna go collect our first item, because why not? <laughs> Honestly, this is a terrible idea, but you know what? We're just gonna try it, because why not? Yo, what up, Mellifilis? It's a very early stream. Uh, the games are going okay, man. The games are going okay. Alright, we're gonna get rid of this mark here, and then we'll keep fighting. We're still two levels up. Go up and do uh, these wolves here. Uh, I kind of want to gank top. Alright. Let's go ahead and go into her jungle. See where she can be. Award that. Well, I probably should have warded deeper. Checking Gromp. Gromp's gone. Wolves are gone too? Okay, so she's probably on both sides of the map. We know this is going to spawn. I'm actually going to go right here. Okay, that's pinked. They're really, really low. I did a lot of damage to them. This should be our dragon, honestly. Uh... Took phase rush. Yeah, that's ours. Collector came in. Uh, we still have Rift Herald, so we can potentially like Rift Herald after this, but we'll, we'll, we'll see. Yeah, I want to pull it out here versus Kindred. Okay, we got the drag. Uh, turret plating is falling, so Rift. I, I really want to riff this for turret plating folds. Oh my god, riff, please be faster. It should be okay. Got 320 gold. Yeah, we, we got a lot of gold there, so we're really rich right now. Um, I really don't want to fight, guys. Minion should kill him. Or me. Okay. I guess that was just free kills, but... Oh, the amount of gold I had, I really didn't want to fight. But, you know what? It's fine. Had really good ultis there. The Kindred again is now level 8, so she'll be two levels behind again. But, you know, we have an entire jungle to farm. You know, it might be weird that I went Collector first, but I saw that I, like how much of a lead I had on Kindred, so I wanted to have like a full item. I didn't want to go back and have like a Noon Quiver. Like, it, it's not that big of an advantage. Where, like, if you have an entire item, even if the I this item isn't like super, super ideal, like if I run into her with a full item, like it doesn't matter what the fuck it is, like I'll probably win. If she has nothing, you know? If 
I have like a long sword on her, you know, and like a crit cloak, like a non-complete immortal shield bow, that literally does nothing, you know? So I'm still gonna power farm, you know? I'm not gonna like go run top or something or like run mid. I wanna keep power farming so I'm like stronger, stronger, stronger the entire the entirety of the game. And then like when a big objective like a Baron or a Dragon does come up, um, you know, we're like miles ahead. Team's popping right now, and we have 3.5k. So right now we can just buy like a shield bow if we wanted to. Um, let's see. Yeah, we'll go. Actually, we'll, we'll try Gale Force. I've, n I've I haven't really played Gale Force Graves, but you know what? We're gonna try it because because why not? You know why not? We're gonna have a lot of move speed in addition to our phase rush. kind of why I didn't want to uh, really go there, but um, Rift Herald is up. I'm going to go to my pink ward here. I can literally walk on them. We had Gale Force there, actually. That was good. The Gale Force uh, pickup actually came in clutch. And again, we're just gonna keep farming now. When you're playing Graves and you're like in a positive, like really good uh, jungle matchup, you have two jungles, your own and then theirs. All right, I'm gonna do Rift Herald now. And then our next item is gonna be IE. Like I'm not even gonna hesitate. I don't really need the attack speed or the tier two boots really. I, I wanna just like keep one shotting, you know? Like I'm not doing anything like mechanically flashy or anything like that, as you can see. Like you don't need to do that. You really just need to be like really smart about the game. Like I'm literally just right clicking and two shotting people. I'm gonna push mid here. We have Rift Herald, guys. Uh, kind a little bit early to take this um tower, but we're gonna try it anyway. I threaten like a dive here. I don't have Gale Force yet, so we're gonna do this. I'm not really worried about their dragon here. They're all up though, so I'm just gonna leave actually. Yeah. Kinda baited that guy, not gonna lie. Jesus, man. You know, we baited them far enough so that, you know, he ran into our team and they're literally going to lose the game because of that. But it's okay. You know, they got our shut down, but it'll be, it's, it'd be like that sometimes, man. It really do. All right, well, we got more damage here. So, yeah. Collector diff indeed. We don't have to do Baron, we can literally just go top or bot, but, um, you know, we're versus Ziggs, um, and we do have that maiden hip down, but I want to make sure that, like, we don't waste time, because in a lot of these uh, ratings, people just kind of ARAM, you know, when there's other stuff to take around the map.
again, mid's pushing right now, so we're just gonna wait for mid to push. Uh, their jungler's down, so... Yeah. This might be kind of an int, but... Should be okay. Okay. We're gonna go do Baron now. Their jungler's down right now. Uh, I kinda was gonna greed for the Gromp, but we'll settle for the Crab. For level 13. We have a max quick draw now. So we should be really, really tanky. Like when we're fully stocked. So five. So if we were fully stacked guys, if we were fully stacked on quick draws, we'd have around 220 armor or something like that. Which is like insane if you think about it, right? For a ranged uh, hard damage uh, hero. Uh, thinking about the plays I can make here, but again, we Mordecai's is pushing mid. He ulted, which is like really good, but we're gonna go ahead and ult him. Collector kills both Kindred and Malzahar since they were both low. That's why Collector is like pretty good on graves. And there it is. That player right there got them to surrender. So, good shit. I'm telling you, after, after the buffs, graves is gonna be insane. Even though 2 AD might not seem like a lot, helping his early clear even a little bit more makes him, like, pretty strong. But yeah, what a game. Let's look at the damage that we did. We take those. Alrighty.